askew. Welcome to this week's episode of Science with Sean. It's a special Halloween edition, especially to help you if you have any of that leftover Halloween candy, namely Skittles. We're actually gonna turn these Skittles, instead of tasting the rainbow, we're gonna be dissolving the rainbow and showcasing a little bit of artwork as well. Now, as far as the ingredients that you're gonna need, you really just need a good old dinner plate or paper plate, any sort of plate, some hot water, and some Skittles. So let's get started with this week's experiment. All right, so we're adding those Skittles piece by piece. Of course, you can kind of just throw them all on there. And just have them in a single file line around the plate. And of course, you can get really technical and match certain colors, to make certain designs, but the main thing is you're gonna just have to have them in a single file. And there we go. All right, so now that your Skittles are in a single file line around the plate, next up, add some warm to hot water and pour it in the center. Just enough so it fills up, starts touching the Skittles. As each Skittle starts dissolving its food coloring and sugar in the water, you start to get your own colorful path for each Skittle. All right, and there you go. See our beautiful design just made out of pouring water onto Skittles. And just because you've dissolved the food coloring and the sugar off of the coating of the Skittles, doesn't mean the Skittles have to go to waste. In fact, you can eat them just like you normally would, just they'd be a little bit naked, I guess, without their color on them. And of course, you probably have some leftover Skittles too, so you can play with those as well. We actually have a whole host of science experiments on our website too, one actually involving a pumpkin volcano too. Feel free to check those out on WMBFnews.com, click on the weather tab, and then find Science with Sean. For this week's episode, I'm first alert meteorologist Sean Bailey.